All right, so for your first project is the charger. So you'll need the glue, Mod Podge glue, the Mod Podge sealer, um, the glitter, of course, your brush, and a Dollar Tree plate. I'm just gonna use this little one right here just to uh, use for my glue. Now all you're gonna do is apply the glue evenly all around your plate. There is really no rhyme or reason. Um, just uh, try not to apply it too thick um, because you want it to dry and you don't want it to be clumpy when it dries. I don't know if you can see it here, but there is actually a line that you can go by. Um, just try not to go in the inside part with your glue. You're just gonna um, apply the glue until you cover the whole plate. Um, try to work a little fast, but at the same time, be careful because you don't want glue everywhere. This is what it looks like when you've applied all of your glue and then just add your glitter. Now, before you add glitter or use any glitter, you wanna uh, get newspaper. Newspaper is good to have because it's easy for the cleanup part. And you'll see that later. So just sprinkle your glitter all around your charger, um, everywhere that, you, that you've applied the glue. Right, and then just dust it off. That's what it looks like. Now you may have to go over it again because it may be little spots that you've missed. Um, this is what I mean by easy cleanup. So you'll just uh, use that same glitter for the next time around. Now this time uh, when you apply your glue, um, you're just gonna dab it. Just dab it all around the plate. Um, you don't you try not to rub it because you may rub some of the previous glitter off. So the same step you just want to dab this time and um, apply your glitter. Once you've applied your glitter all around, you'll spray it with the sealer and try to go outside with because that stuff is is kind of strong. So I always go outside to spray it and then let it dry for about an hour. And that's really it. Um, just do your cleaning up. Uh, just clean up the middle because you may have little blitz and splatter of glitter. And this is the end result for the charger. That's what it looks like. Um, of course, you've probably seen that before when you add your decor. Now for the second project, uh, which are the goblets. You're gonna need mostly the same, the most of the same of material, except for you're gonna add the glass and you're gonna need the candle holders and the fur, of course. This is the fishbowl candle holder. I used this for a previous project, so you see that I have um, a little bling around the rim of it. And then you'll need the candlestick holder. And of course, now that one comes in um, stripes and, and polka dots. We're just going to use the polka dots for this one. And of course, like I said, um, get your newspaper down and apply your Mod Podge all over your fish bowl until you've cut or covered it all. Once you've done it, um, then you'll just apply your glitter. Sprinkle glitter all around. Now for this one, I wouldn't do uh, apply a second coat. Um, all you need is one for this for this project. And then spray it with your sealer, of course. Now you'll need to um, take your candle holder 
uh, and turn it upside down and apply my podge. No, not my podge. I'm sorry. You'll apply E6000 glue and the uh, hot gun. Add your candlestick. Make sure it's centered. And then you'll just apply your uh, strip of fur um, around the bottom where you've glued the two together. You can use either E6000 or the hot glue gun. And um, you can use any type of confetti. I, I bought mine from Michaels a while back. Um, but let's say you can use any type of confetti you like and just add it to the candlestick. Now for your globe, um, you're just going to apply your uh, broken glass. Uh, the broken glass I brought from Michaels. Um, it came in the pack that you've seen before in the beginning of the video. Uh, but you'll apply that broken glass with the hot glue gun only. And you can do, um, you know, as much as you like until you're satisfied. After you're done gluing all of your broken glass, um, you're just going to glue um, the globe to the candlestick using hot glue and E6000. That's um, actually it. Um, that's all to it. Um, I actually completed a set of three in which you'll see here. You can do as many as you like. Um, so let me know what you thought about this project. Uh, let me know what you thought in the comments. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.